Cincinnati at SMU. Uh, SMU is a three and a half point home dog. The total sits at 58 and a half. It's another 12 p.m. Eastern time game. This one's on ESPN. Let's go ahead and pull up the numbers. Uh, my numbers like Cincinnati minus 3.74. So it is literally right on the number right there. I mean, just crazy. Uh, the strength of schedule for Cincinnati doesn't look great. SMU has been through a gauntlet. Uh, but truth be told, SMU is 0-5 against the spread in their last five games. Like, they have not looked good. They are 0-4 against the spread in the last four at home. Um, for Cincinnati, Ben Bryant, concussion, confirmed from Luke Fickle. Uh, so he's day-to-day. Not sure, you know, at Prather may end up playing on that one. Uh, as far as Cincinnati, I mean, 0-3-1 and against the spread in their last four games. Um on the road, excuse me, Cincinnati is 4-1 and one against the spread in their last five against SMU. You know, I, I start looking at these numbers, and while the SMU offense is really good, that Cincinnati defense is a beast. Like, that is something, they're not going to be able to take advantage of some of the same passing explosiveness, et cetera, that they did against Navy last week. While Cincy is not great in passing explosiveness, they are number nine in passing success rate. They are number 16 in PPA per pass. Uh, and then you start looking at things like points per scoring opportunity, and there's not a, a massive advantage for SMU in this spot. There is a massive advantage for Cincinnati's offense. Uh, they're not great at running the football, but even if you're not great at running the football, you do have a really good offensive line. They're number 19 in offensive line yards, number 9 in stuff rate. SMU is terrible on defense. Their front seven is really, really bad against the run, so that is something to pay attention to. Standard downs PPA Cincy number 49, uh, SMU is number 96, so Cincy should be able to stay ahead of the chains here. Um, as far as, you know, if if Cincy were to get into passing downs, you know, third and long, et cetera, if they, if they get behind the chains, they're number 41 in passing downs PPA. So they're pretty successful in that spot. I, I look at this, I think Cincinnati. I hate the hook here, but I'll probably ride with Cincinnati on this. Uh, you look at, you know, turnover margin, Penalties per game, et cetera. SMU certainly has a lean in penalties per game. They are incredibly disciplined. Cincinnati, though, a lot of theirs can sometimes just be from aggression. And when you are an aggressive defense, yeah, you're going to get penalties called on you, but it can absolutely work in your favor. So this is one of those spots where even though the fundamentals don't point that direction, uh, I'm going to lean Cincinnati. I think they've got more talent. I think they are... Uh, I think they're just an overall better football team. So, yeah. Yeah, give me the Bearcats to cover three and a half on the road at SMU, even if Ben Bryant does not play. I think they are still the better football team.